Hello friends and welcome to my new episode. Today we are on day 11 and our prompt is handmade stamp and jumbo tag. This is going to be a very colorful ephemera because we are working with a toucan. So the first thing I'm going to be using is this illustration and I'm going to convert it into a jumbo tag. So what I'm doing is I'm measuring one inch out of the frame of the toucan all the way around. About three inches from here and three inches. So we do it this way. I have my tag is going to be 5.5 inches and length is eight inches. I'm gonna cut it right away. So here let me just go ahead and cut that and with the same angle I come over here I twist it and I have that so I make sure that my cuttings are same weight length and what I want is to follow that line and make like an L shape here so I go right down here and also here so I have my L I think the hardest part is going to be building the stamp. So this is the way I want it. I'm going to glue it right away. So in the meantime, while I work with the other part, this is going to be gluing down. The main thing I didn't cut the toucan around is because I love this background here with the leaves and all these details. They are very cute and original, so I didn't cut this. And now I want the envelope. By the way, I'm using a paper coming out from a bag of a grocery store. Let me show you. This is the bag. I already destroyed half of it. It's really, really nice because it's super cute. So when I saw it, I said, no way. I need to use this in my ephemeras this year. Okay, I'm ready to glue my envelope and I'm gonna glue it sideways. Let's do something different today. What do you think? I'm in love with the result. Now I am going to go with my Distress Ink Vintage Photo. good thing is that you can always cut this more or change something that you don't like. So now let's go to the second part of this ephemera for today and I'm going to make the stamp. I'm going to be using this cardboard and I'm just gonna cut like probably a tiny piece like two inches of that and as this is a tropical bird and we need to make a stamp. I'll do something different. I go more with something like that. The thing is that I can't like be cutting too much. Yes, I'm gonna do the simple shape. And now you can see what is gonna happen. So here I'm going to go around. You take the paper, it comes with paper on both sides. 
So you take the paper out like so and cut the extra Take a little bit of the foam around the stamps Okay, let's see what happened Wow, this is my special moment I can't wait to place the acrylic here and to stamp it by the way, I'm going to make a test before I do it on my tag, so I'm going to be using this paper here. Well, I'll go with this bright orange here, vermilion, because the toucan is really, really colorful. See what happened. Let me do it on top of here. Oh wow, I love it. I guess. Okay, are you ready for this? Let's do it. Um, I'm gonna go like around here. Wow, I'm in love with this. I really love it. Going to go with green now. The thing is that I don't have to press too much. That was the problem. I pressed too much on the stamp. You need to go like really, really soft because this material is really soft. So don't press too much. I'm gonna go on top of this. Just go gently and like that. You see? Much better. Much better. it a little bit of a touch with the brush so I don't we can see the shape of the leaf actually it turned out like those leaves that have like different colors I really wanted an orange color. My tag, jumbo tag with a stamp. Let's cover my token and let's go with the splatters. I'm gonna do some green. So let's start with the splatters now. I have the orange and green. I'm going to start with a light color. So then you can just switch colors without washing the brush. I cover my toucan's face and let's do this. I'm in love with the, this technique. Love the splatters. 
All right, now let's go with the green. This is the final look of my project. What do you think? We have a jumbo tag and a stamp made out of a foam board. In order to finish this project, I'm going to use this quote is from Luciano Pavarotti that says, people think I am disciplined. It is not discipline, it is devotion. There is a great difference. I'm in love with this quote coming from Luciano Pavarotti, devotion, an angel reminder. This comes from a book that I have about angels that I love, like the devotion I'm going to go here, devotion, it can be devotion for art. I was keeping this special quote for something special and I'm using it with my jumbo tag. And then Luciano Pavarotti is going to go here, probably there on the envelope, what do you think? I think it's nice. This is my final ephemera. So look at the result, all the splatters and all the colors that took and inspired me. And then the amazing quote from Luciano Pavarotti. People think I'm disciplined. It is not discipline, it is devotion. There is a great difference and it's dedicated to devotion. So what do you think? So if you like this project, follow on this. And now the special moment, another check is going to come in here. So handmade and jumbo tag is ready. See you soon, friends. Thanks for joining me in this amazing journey. Bye-bye, friends. Bye.